It would have been a bit of gigantic mistake for me not to be a Pittsburgh Steeler. Having the opportunity to, to work for an outstanding organization, the Roonies, and uh, be coached by Chuck Noll, and be joined by, you know, in, in preceding years by uh, obviously some fantastic players. And, you know, we had great camaraderie and we had a great time playing football here in Pittsburgh. Uh, we had a great locker room and we, we practiced hard because you know, we had that coach that he wouldn't, he wouldn't sell for anything less. Over the course of time, we found out that that was the best way. My very, very first day, Chuck said, I go to see him, win the Super Bowl. There was some chuckles going on in, in, in that room. A couple of them I got cut because of it. He wasn't talking about, obviously, that season, but every year the goal is to win. And uh, ultimately, as you know, we, we got there. You know, I came here the same, same year that uh, LC did. A year later, we got uh, Mel Blount and uh, the Blonde Bomber. Jack Ham, he joined us. Later on, Franco did, and Dwight White and Ernie Holmes. The year that Stahl and, and Swanee came, they brought along Jack Lambert and Webby. You know, it was, it was, it was perfect. It was perfect, uh, you know, and I, I was the oldest of all of those guys, but not by much. So we kind of grew up together. We learned the Chuck Noll way together. Well, we went, we went, it was a full team meeting and Chuck was in front of the group. It was the day after we beat Buffalo to, to go to the AFC Championship. Well, the Dolphins were playing uh, the Raiders and the Dolphins were positioning to be, to win three in a row. And the Raiders won that ball game. And uh, in uh, Coach Madden's exuberance, he said that the two best teams in football would play today, and this was the Super Bowl. And uh, that day in our meeting, Chuck said, well, fellas, the Super Bowl wasn't played yesterday. It's going to be played in two weeks and the best team in football is sitting right here in this room. I don't know, I just kind of levitated out of my seat and everybody else let up a big, big whoop and it was a done deal. Done deal. Standing on the sideline, we got the ball and the clock's ticking away. And I'm looking at L.C., Dwight, and Ernie. And that was just about the best feeling I ever had. And, it, and I, it was us going to the Super Bowl and our history all in the same, same mix. Football for me was the thrill of the hunt. We were hunting each other. I'm hunting you and you're hunting me. And in doing so, we were playing the games of our lives. And what happens? When I play my best, they play their best, we get a great contest. That's to me, that is football to me, as it should be.